San Luis Obispo swimmer Emily Giannini has been swimming since she was nine years old, and her dream has always been to swim at the collegiate level. After years of preparation, especially in the past year, she has made her dream a reality, committing to swim at Cal State East Bay in the fall. It's been a goal for me for a long time. It's something that I've always thought like swimming is something that I've always loved, so I think I can continue on with it and do even better. She's just had a passion for it from the get-go, and it's never left her, and she just kind of had a natural talent for it. She is driven, respectful, she leads by example, and we value her very much. We're going to miss her next year, but we wish her good luck with the pioneers up there at Cal State East Bay. The Cal State East Bay swimming program is known for the success that they've had under Coach Pelton. They've won like two conference championships since he's been there, so, and they're like top 20 in the nation, so they're really, they're really fast. We will be at every meet that we can be at. <laughs> we're, yeah. we're super excited to watch her swim in college. It's been her dream. This past year was a difficult one for athletes to keep on training in the midst of the pandemic. And with most pools closed, Emily kept on training in the ocean in Morro Bay, where the water this time of year is freezing. It's like 50 to 51 degrees right now. She decided to keep swimming in the bay at Morro Bay. So she did this on her own. I think this whole thing with the COVID-19 just fueled her passion and she realized, wow, I don't have a lot of time left. So she's taken advantages of the opportunities that she's been given. She never gave up. I mean, this whole COVID thing, I think it was just an example of how dedicated she was, really. I mean, it was amazing. But until she joins the prestigious program at Cal State East Bay, there's still work to do in the Tigers cap. We hopefully as a team, we can win league and then and then hopefully I can qualify for state. That's, that's a big goal of mine. <laughs> I mean, having someone like Emily on your team is, it makes coaching a lot easier because people look up to her and they see her working hard. So they work just as hard and they're proud of her. I think everyone takes a sense of pride of being a Tiger, knowing that someone like Emily comes through the program and is able to get into the next level. Reporting for KSBY Sports, I'm Casey Busher.